don't know who the fuck to trust. Is it my friend or my foe? I'm my some exit bro. Yeah, she give me that claim as well. I remember back when I was younger, I was happy. Now they feel like no one understand me. I'm good at artists, silly, I'm about to blame me. Baby, see yellow text. Guys, welcome to a blisteringly hot Dorset. It is 32 degrees today, it's that Friday. Today we're gonna go over, I wanna do a handover with Luke. He's got a TT, um, which is absolutely lush, copper bronze van. And I also wanna show you the mullet, which VWT have, have named the most beautiful, um, Bentley green combi sleeper slash MTBR I think that's ever been created that Jay and I worked really hard on and just show it to you in its raw light really because all the pictures are in the moody uh, hangar and, um, and just all artistic so I think it's gonna be really cool to show that van off in its raw state. I'm excited. Come on then. Luke. Check out your new van, man. Uh, I don't like it. Oh, oh, I, do, I do like it. <laughs> it's not, it looks nice. I trusted you with the, uh, with, with the colour and yeah, it's turned out nice. It's all fully themed. So we've got a little bit of grey up on your top streamer here. Yeah. A little bit of grey coming around here. You've then got your Indian grey um, Gen 1 Sport lines. A little bit of carbon fibre up here on the top. Then that grey flows all the way through the bottom of the side skirt. And as we come around the back, you've got your carbon fibre rear. And it just wraps around yeah, the back of the van. That flows really nice. Very nice. Cool, eh? Happy. Thank you, mate. No worries. Boom. How cool was that van that we just handed over to Luke? Oh, he's so happy with it. He was just driving off. He was like, I'm so excited to drive all the way back up to North Wales. Um, glad the AC is well and truly cold. This is this that this is the van. Um, so Lindsay, the owner, Jay and myself worked really hard designing this, this van. We wanted it to be extremely regal, very, very classy, and all about the tier one. It is totally bonkers when you get up close and look at the detail. Little bits like the blended carbon wheel arches, the three-piece bottoms which we had made for, for, for this van are exquisite. You guys, what you're seeing on your screens now, honestly, I cannot stress to you, when you get up and close to these insane wheels, um, just how mental they are. Classic British regal vibes on a baller transporter was, uh, was the brief. We went for an Oxblood and Bentley British Racing Green, complemented with a little bit of gold. Always three points of colour, so the Van Haven badge is really important to the side aesthetics of this van. Um, with a 6mm and a 2mm pinstripe, which is totally classic right back down to the 1930s and 40s when pinstriping was done by hand these aren't these are obviously decals um, and really showed an extra uh, air of class on, on on the vehicle every angle that we look at this van it's always got some point that um, that draws the eye in so when we're looking at the rear of the van especially when the pop tops roofs roofs up it's all drawn down, a little bit of carbon fibre raw there on the, on the hinge of the pop top, comes down over the TTR spoiler, brawls your eye down, smoke lights, and then we've got that beautiful TTRC rear diffuser, 
and, um, and these black, uh, black chrome exhaust systems. All the exhaust systems we put on these vans here are completely silent when you're actually out driving. They actually sound their best when it's at idle. Just a really nice gentle burble. Um, it's not abrasive or loud or echoes when you drive close to a wall. They're, they're, they're completely silent when we're driving. It's purely so there's no fakery, no fake exhaust tips or anything. When we look at the side profile of this particular van, everything is completely uniform. So, slight colour change on the ox blood. We could have made it slightly brighter, but what we didn't want it to do was look anything a little bit too chintzy. So, I went for a really, really sedate ox blood and then put um, exactly the same colour piping as all the factory plastics within this van, just to keep that flow going. And then we've got a huge focal system in this thing, which will blow your mind off. Um, all of that's hidden neatly into the, uh, where, into, into the panel here. And it was for the hi-fi that we couldn't go for a twin slider. Obviously, normally, all of our vans here at Van Haven are a twin slider. But for this particular project, uh, I, I needed to have monoblock amplifiers with crossovers and a whole load of other stuff that Chris, who is our in-house audio geek, um, told me that we needed to put. Um, there's also got some really cool little lights in there and stuff, so it's quite cool and it's all vented. So at the bottom of that panel, we've got uh, an inward and an outward style um, uh, ventilation system, which is mad cool and completely silent. Um, we couldn't have any noise coming from those little fans, so Chris had to work some he had to work his phone real hard basically to get us some silent ones and it's worked out really nicely. With the dashboard, um, that colour tone with a little bit of brushed aluminium on the side of the T6 steering wheel, T6.1 steering wheel is really nice. So I wanted to get a real pop out of that. So with the pedals and the gear stick, they were actually matched to make sure that everything was completely uniformed. And then originally, I went for an LMI1 internal optics on all the handles and whatnots, but it just didn't flow quite so nicely. So um, after a discussion with Lindsay, we decided that it just all had to go black. Black on absolutely everything, and then just a slight contrast with the yellow speakers from that Focal system that's been put in here. It just is so premium. This van now is actually got for sale, which I got mixed emotions. I'm very excited for the new person to obviously jump in and experience it and touch it and use it and enjoy it. Um, but I'm just quite sad that Lindsay only managed to enjoy 5,000 miles before his, his next project. He ended up using this as his daily, uh, which is testament to the suspension and the wheels and how quiet and refined it is, but also its usability. So, over the years he's obviously had some cool cars like he said in this feature but um, it's really nice to know that someone would jump into this and enjoy driving it enjoy its experience so much that it actually became their daily so um, yeah smug face feel very happy with that usability and stuff in the back oh my god mental so we've obviously got the drawer with that little cool the shelf on the top for your wheels and stuff so he fitted four full-size mountain bikes in the back of this van, along with his water tanks and his compressors and everything in there. It really is a go anywhere, go and play. It was all about enjoyment. So yes, you can go and buy a sports car and you get a certain amount of enjoyment out of that, don't get me wrong, but this is offering so much more versatility to your life. And for the same price as a Rangey, oh my God, doesn't it just do so much more you can rock up to a five-star hotel in this and steal the, the, the car park without a shadow of a doubt. But you can also go into the woods, go riding in it, you can sleep in it, you can crank up the tunes in it. It's so versatile. I just, what a tool. Uh, what a tool for, for, for life and enjoyment. Come and see it in the flesh. If you want to see this van, please come to site, we'll show you around what we do here. 
but it really is worthy of a, of a journey. If you're into your transporters, if you are doing a build at the moment and you want some inspiration or you would like to see how um, us guys do it here at Van Haven and you want any tips or advice, pick up the phone, come and see us, come and have a look at this thing. The fit and finish that the boys in the workshop have done on this van is is the best in the industry and I am a picky man. I will find fault in everything. It is my job to do so. And when we sign this van off, there will not be a single fault and there is not a single fault. A couple of things on the front here, a few little tiny details. So we've got our shadow pack, which we've developed in house. Um, it's really hard work. It's a hard process to work, but we absolutely love that. It looks just looks so correct on the front of this van. Um, I've, got a, I've got a client called Stevie and he'd say, Ollie, that looks well. Um, and I agree with that. And I really like how um, Marcus has managed to get a little bit of silver just from the badge running through in some of the most important parts when the sun hits the van. Um, I also really like how we've done a smoked lacquer on the struts down here. I think the contrast between the, um, the tinted lacquer and then we move to this beautiful raw lacquer down here and then with the smoke just looks absolutely epic and talking about little details there is just a little bit marcus when he was painting this he just put a tiny bit of green just on the front leading edge which are lush and um, i really like that i think that's a really cool touch the van itself is a 204 long wheelbase panel van. She started her life off as white and um, she's got all the main bells and whistles. So everything that you would expect on a top spec transporter, she obviously has. Sorry we haven't been too active on YouTube at the moment. It's silly season. So everyone wants their vans for the summer and we're all working really hard, smashing out the overtime to make sure that you get your vans quickly um, without rushing them, obviously. It's really important that they're no rush policy continues. Thank you, we'll see you very soon. Hopefully I will be less sweaty and less scruffy the next time I see you. Pleasure to show you that and to talk to you around it. It's just very proud, all of us here at Van Haven about this van. Um, come and see her and she's for sale. So um, if you've got any questions, ring me. Everyone knows my number, so it's, it just pick up the phone. I will gladly tell you everything in um, as much detail as I possibly can and thank you so much for, for watching one of our videos again. Take it easy guys, I am going to my office where it's air conditioned and cold and lovely because in here is poor old Sean and Reg working in here polishing vans. Woo! Take them out of here boys. Take it easy. Got the key to the van, rolling with you, coming up you. I came here to skank a fast through. Bad boy chiller, I'm rock with the crew. But you wanna skank out, then here's what to do. Close to the left, 